Tree Fort offers such a wide variety of artistic expression, and skateboarding is no different. I'm your Idaho Backroads neighborhood reporter, Steve Dent, here at Road Skate Park for Skateboard. Music and skateboarding comes together at Skate Fort, where riders had the opportunity to skate in a party atmosphere with live music. And it's not just skateboarding. Freestyle scootering has become really popular. And these kids can do some really cool tricks. Chase Waller tried it after an injury. Yeah, because I used to skateboard, broke my arm, and then it scared me. So I, but I still wanted to be at the skate park, so I just like tried scootering. Very but cool. Okay. The community is the best part. The community comes together for skate for it, thanks to Boise Parks and Rec and the Boise Skateboard Association, who has worked together to bring community skate parks to different parts of the city. A new one will open in Ivy Wild this spring, but Rhodes continues to be the central hub. Yeah, we're so lucky, so fortunate. This, this park is held in such high regard. Um, there's a lot of great parks. There's a lot of fantastic skate parks, but this, this one is unique. It does have a very different layout, and uh, there's just a lot of different special things about this place. Kaylee Schweitkart enjoys skateboarding because there's no rules. Everybody has their own style, and everyone is welcome. It's grown um, a ton. I see now that there's a lot more women on skateboards now, and um, the diversity is amazing. There's a, there's a bunch of different kinds of skateboarders now, and um, there's a lot of more uh, local companies coming out. I'm your Idaho Backroads neighborhood reporter, Steve Dent, for Idaho News 6.